make so a this some music that made white people mad. Don't make a man. Yeah, this is shit to blow your speakers out. This is shit you dream about. You can... Why the case Swift more on the phone? No. <clears throat> Alright, you join us. What is this, episode 3? Yes, episode 3. Joining us today is my good mate, George Stalker. Yes. <laughs> He's gonna, he's gonna be helping us out. Basically, what we've got here is the uh, fender flares coming. And you might remember from uh, last episode, I said that uh, I wasn't going to run the spacers. But now looking at looking at the fender flares, I think it's gonna give us a lot of cutting room to run said spacers. So what we're gonna do is test fit test fit the wheels with the spacers. So maybe we might get some bit of fitment. On it because right now it's uh, yeah, so we're gonna put a spacer on. Let's see if we get better fitment. If we do, we're gonna do some more cutting. Uh -huh. The spacer's in question. Are you <laughs> <laughs> okay? All right, so let's quickly do it. <coughs> So as you can see, that happened. <clears throat> so as you can see, with the spacers, it has much better fitment. It's more flush. It's more flush, isn't it? Yeah. It's way more flush. Uh, what the? Uh... Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> what these flares allows us to do is to cut a lot more into here, which means. Should be able to clear. Oops. No, I'm not really sure. Was I having issues here with that? I can't remember. When you put it on full lock and see how much it cuts it.
Let me try to let, let it's so annoying. Yeah, let me break it down so I can build it back up. I'm still I'm feeling what I'm feeling because what I'm feeling is love. Yep. So fresh, ever fresh with that prime time cut. No need to act. I'm not even trying to do stuff. I take my time settling for the vibe. Not a skit is still incredible. Going back in the book. With potential to shine. Stay calm on my mind because Chris Paul be looking at me like, Rennie, will you get all them down? Good man, good mate. Thank you. All right. So as you can see. <laughs> as you can see. <coughs> sorry, excuse me. We have cut quite a bit more out of this arch. Hello. Hello. It's a lot nicer than the cut that there was before. And now we're just gonna as you can see we're just gonna drop it now. Test the fitment. See or oh, check for clearance and uh, if we're good we're gonna touch it up with some paint we'll force it to for a bit seal it with some rubber sealers and then um, we want to get us on it hopefully we have the clearance we should be alright okay we're good on that side I think we're good might just rub the um, uh, I think that's the other side. Might rub the arch, the, uh, the lining just a bit, but I don't think that's a big deal. Oh, do the front again. Come back on the front. It's completely fine. Okay, it rubs on the, uh, on the lining, which means I'm going to have to like completely take it out. I kind of want to take it out completely, but... Still take yourself out, but it doesn't hit the bumper or anything. Yeah, it just clears. Yes, completely fine. So that's... That side is completely fine, so. We are going to uh, <coughs> seal it with some paint and then put some rubber seal on it and then put the um, put the fender flare on the side. The side should be done. So we are gonna move on to, should we do the, um, the back? Should we do that side since we're here? Or should we do the front and then do both backs? All right, we have made much progress. Uh, I think we should talk about it a little bit first. Um, yeah, so we cut the first layer of skin to find out the second layer was a structural component. So I don't think it's a good idea to cut into that. Plus, I don't think we have the tool to even cut into that. No. So we're going to leave that. Turns out by just hammering a bit, we've created enough clearance. Look at that. I think that is more, more than enough clearance. So. Yep, I'm gonna put a fender flare on that as is. Now the front, I have gone round the cut in this rubber seal and it looks so clean. So like this, like you could leave it like this, right? And it doesn't, it just looks clean. Yeah, it looks clean as hell. So what we're gonna do now next is uh, put the, uh, the rubber sealant thing along the perimeter along the edges of the uh, fender flare and uh, install it and then move on to the uh, to the other side so yeah we've made quite a lot of progress it is looking good we're almost done we're almost done all right flares are going on now Saki had this brilliant idea to use these what are these called again super screws, super screws. look at them make light work of that Oh, it's brilliant. Self-tapping. And I actually quite like how they look as well. Yeah. I like that. That's it dope. looks better than what a, a rivet would look. Yeah. I much like these. It's dope. Oh, I quite like that. I think we need to get a move on to actually. Yeah. So we're going to do the other side. But that looks... Incredible. Yeah, we only have two of these for the moment. Um, so the rears... 
I'm gonna have no fenders for now. But okay, we're gonna get <laughs> All right, let's do the other side. All right, it's been a long ass day. We have been at this. Look at look at how tired our faces. I'm gone. <laughs> we have been at this for hours, and uh, we have made some progress. So the car is now drivable. It wasn't drivable before. The car is now drivable. Uh, we still have a few rubbing issues on the rear when it uh, hits a bump when it squats a bit so I'm gonna solve that by raising the height at a later date but for now it's drivable uh, at the front we have installed the fender flares there's still work to be done as you can see <sighs> it's looking mean as hell right now but I'm gonna I'm gonna maybe like shave this in a bit to give it more of a I don't know I don't know but Perhaps I might just leave it like this because I'm just tired of this right now. I'm just sick and tired of this right now. Um, I haven't got any flares for the rears because they are out of stock. So I'm going to wait till those are back in stock and then order them and then have them fitted. But that shouldn't be a problem. So yeah, this took a lot of cutting. But now we have no clearance issues. For some reason, I have issues on the left side here. The wheel hits this right here but on the other side on the other side on this side it's just fine so I'm not sure what's up with this car's asymmetry but <sighs> it's a little dodgy but yeah that's done I'm sick of it uh, Starkey is sick of it yeah we gotta go to KFC get something to eat I'm starving I haven't eaten all day I don't actually remember having breakfast today so uh, yeah we're gonna get something to eat and that will be the end of that I'll be revisiting the car until later date, probably next week or something. But yeah, the car is not done yet, so I'll be catching you in the next one. <coughs>